I can hardly wait to go on our vacation to trampoline land. All right, here we go. Authorities say that two people were attacked by Bigfoot while they were camping. Oh my goodness. I didn't think Bigfoot was even real. Me neither. But the news said that people were attacked by him. Wow, I always thought that Bigfoot was kind of shy. I wonder if the people were being mean to Bigfoot. Good question. I always kind of wanted to see Bigfoot, but not up close. Whoa, bump, bump. What? That was a huge bump. There's no speed bump sign. I don't know what that was all about. I don't know. Trampoline Land has also experienced some seismic activity. There have been some vibrations, which is unusual because there are no records of earthquakes at Trampoline Land. There's the old military base. It's been seeming to make it more fun for grown-ups and children. Wow, they say the vibrations make things even funner at Trampoline Land. Well, we're almost here. Did you bring our our uh, money and our luggage? Sure did. I think we're ready to go. Okay. Oh, it's so exciting. Ever since they've got these car carrying planes, I've always wanted to go somewhere with one. All right, here we are. We're coming in for a landing. Two weeks later. Hooray, it's time to go back. Mm. Oh, I'm definitely feeling those vibrations today. I wonder what's going on. It's got to be some kind of an earthquake. There must be a fault here that people didn't know about. Hi there, folks. Ready to go back home? We sure are. All right, here we go. We're almost back at your home airport here in Snow City. Meanwhile, so. underground, right where the bump was. Since it was going to be spring, the T-Rex had reawoken. Well, that was a super fun vacation, but it's still going to be nice to be back home. You know what you mean. 
It'd be nice to see our pet snake and be able to sleep in our own beds. Yo, what's going on? There's a big dent in the road there. Wait a minute, what's that right up ahead of us? It looks like a, a T-Rex! Can't be real, can it? It's gotta be real, it just moved. Look at that, it's moving around. This is terrifying, but he doesn't seem to be looking at us, and he seems a little shocked. Maybe we should just keep driving past him. Good idea. Gotta get home somehow. Can you believe that? Should call the police and let them know. Got it. <laughs> Dialing right now. Hello, police. We saw a T Rex back there on Snow Boulevard. Ha! You're joking. Don't you know dinosaurs are extinct? Yeah. Okay. I guess this is the day. We we signed all the papers and now we're ready to move into our new house. Here we go. Yeah, that underground house in the snow wasn't, didn't have very much room. And this one actually will get some sunshine so we can have a garden. Uh, we can even have an inside garden in the windows. That's going to be great. Huh, why is there a big pool here? I don't know, but let's keep driving. This was close to where we saw that T-Rex at one time. Wait a second. There is a T-Rex in a hole near where the people were going back to their snow house. What? Did you hear that? The radio reported that there really was a T-Rex. Even though the police 911 operator said we were crazy. I knew that was a T-Rex. I don't know why they didn't believe us. Well, you have to admit, it's pretty unusual. Wow, what a beautiful house. I'm so excited about being able to live in a purplish and purplish colored and white egg shaped house. Yep, probably the best house ever I'd say. Meanwhile, under trampoline there's something causing the vibration sir. We found something big. Captain, we've had a Godzilla sighting over by Trampoline Land. Got to send a plane to drop some bombs on him. That thing is, we haven't actually sighted him yet. They said he's not that very big, but that was because it's the tallest person in the world. Whoa, that thing's gigantic! Why did it hit us with? Tail flack!
go with the T-Rex.